today we're going to be opening the Truly Me Spaghetti Dinner Set. Oh my goodness, I'm so excited to open this! So if you didn't know about me, my favorite food is Italian food. Literally, I love it, I love it, I love it. I think I would literally live in Italy. I think I'd do very well living in Italy if I didn't live in America because, you know, I just love, I love Italian food, okay? Okay, it's like my life besides dolls. So I'm very excited to have a Italian food set for my dolls. So I think without further ado, let's get started. So we're actually in the doll house today. We're in the kitchen. I know, very different. And you can actually see baby Waverly now. Anyways, we're in a very different setup. If you guys like this setup, let me know if you would like me to start filming in like my doll rooms. Ooh, look at all these goodies, girl. Okay, so the first thing that jumps out of me is this little thingy. Let's get this open like the pasta tosser type deal. I don't know the exact name, but we're gonna call it the pasta tosser. Very cute, it is plastic. You have an AG star in it, if you guys can see that. So anyways, it's really cute, it's plastic, and honestly, it's kind of like the same material as like one of these things would actually be in real life, only it's like more flimsy, if that makes sense. It's kind of like a flimsy plastic. I feel like that could break kind of easily. So now we're on to the butter. I mean, no, not the butter, the cheese. My God. <laughs> Why did I think this was butter? Well, you could eat butter on pasta. I eat some butter on my pasta. So anyways, here's the block of cheese. Really cute. Makes me feel like, you know, at Olive Garden, how they have, if you've never been to Olive Garden, they have this, like, cute little thing after they bring out your food. They're like, you want some Parmesan on it? And then they have this, like, little thing where, like, you, like, you know, they they roll it, you tell them to stop or whatever. I feel like I'm kind of at Olive Garden with this block of cheese. Why don't we go to the drinks? Because every good meal needs a good drink to go along with it. You know what I mean? Okay, so here's the two drinks. Really cute. So they're both just in like a really cute cup. They're water with a lemon in it. Really cute. Then, you, of course, you have like a really cute little straw. Uh, the straw is pink and white stripe going down. These cups remind me of the cup that you get with Grace's pastry table. Not pastry table. Her bistro table. Her bistro set. Oh, they remind me so much of it. And they kind of remind me of the cups that you get with uh, Blair's set too. Her little restaurant and restaurant accessory set. Where do I want to go next? Do I want to dig into the food or do I want to go into the essentials that you need for the food? So here's this thing is Super duper cute. Oh my goodness. The lid can come off so you can actually be cooking the pasta. This is plastic. Okay, so now we're going to go into the food because this girl's hungry. Oh my goodness. This spaghetti and meatballs. So we're going to be first opening the spaghetti and meatballs. Oh girl, look at all this. Look at all this deliciousness in my hand. She's got the Italian food in her hands. She's got the Italian food in her hands. So here's the spaghetti and meatballs. Oh my goodness, they're so cute. So detailed. I don't know if you can tell the detail on camera, but it's like really, really detailed. Oh my gosh. I love it so much. And I love how they um, included three because you get two plates and stuff in the set. So you get to have two, but then you also have to, well, you also have an extra one, so you maybe could put it in the pot. Something cute like that. Or maybe we can give it to Baby Waverly back there. So this is a salad. I feel like I'm at Olive Garden with this salad because that's like the only Italian restaurant that I know of that I've that like serve salad at the top of my head. The best part of the meal. One of the best parts of the meal. The bread. So here's the bread. It's like so detailed. Oh my god. Next thing. I don't even, I can't even see the box anymore because I'm so far away. Silverware. Oh and a napkin. Why don't we go with silverware first. So here's the two forks. They're just like regular American Girl forks but I feel like they have a little bit more of a bent to them. Is it just me? I think it's just me. I haven't set up any food sets with my dolls in a while, so I think it could be just me. Now let's go to the napkins because, you know, we get messy when eating. They need a napkin. They need to be proper. Um, but yeah, they're just white. They're cloth. Made to clean up any messes. This is heavy. 
this is, this is, this is heavy. This is a thick, this is metal, girl. So here's the trees grater type thing. Feel like I'm at Olive Garden with this. Oh my goodness. Um, love it so much. Literally, and like the texture that this is. <laughs> I love that it's metal. Oh my gosh. Okay, now let's move on to the plates. The nice, gorgeous, beautiful white plates. So here's the two plates that you get in the set. They're white, they're gorgeous. I love white plates. I don't know, there's just something about it just makes it feel so clean and they're plastic just like regular American Girl plates. And then you get this pamphlet and it's just gather around the table. Use these conversation starters at your next meal to learn unexpected facts about your family. Love this photo right here. You have the sushi set, I mean not the sushi set, the Chinese food set, and then you have some questions that you can ask at your next meal. It just has some more American Girl books that you can check out, so on the back, which is really cute. Okay, so now I think, since we got everything out, we should set this stuff up. So why don't we set it up in the kitchen? <laughs> Capello leggero galante, quella chioma, quell'aria brillante, quel vermiglio. Okay everyone, so here's what the set looks like all set up on the table. I think it looks really cute. I'm not gonna lie. I think it looks really cute. I even, you know, Baby Waverly had to get into the fun. Overall, I really love the set. I think it's really cute. Oh my goodness. So thanks for watching this video, everyone. Don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel and follow me on my Instagram if you haven't done so already. It's the same name, Dollies and Rainbows. We have a lot of fun. I have a podcast called The Doll Mom Podcast, so go give that a listen and stuff. Really fun, really awesome, and yeah, super, super cool. Give this video a like if you enjoyed it. Comment down below. So this question kind of ties into the dolls, okay? It's on this little conversation pamphlet that we got in the set. If you were an inventor at a toy company, what toy would you invent? Very fun. Get your creative juices going. Comment down below answering that question. Yeah, I'd love to hear your answer if you're able to comment down below, of course. I think that's it. I think that's all I have to tell you. I'll see you next time. Bye!